Um, we got a lot of work to do. Today, I'm going to put on the coil packs and I'm going to try to get the throttle cable done. So if I could do those two things today, I have work in about an hour and a half, but it's on the computer, so it doesn't really matter. So if I could do those things today, we should be in good shape. I gotta do like two things a week. So let's get going here. So I got this low car TC1000 LS1U uh, throttle cable for a 36 inch um, uh, length. You're gonna have to trim it. This is black. I believe they have other finishes too. Um, I like black, um, it's nice and clean. So this is what we're gonna do right now. We're gonna, we're gonna try to pull out this grommet. This grommet, and I showed you right here. That's the throttle cable on that bracket. So let me do that right now. If anyone has any recommendations for some nice pop-up lights uh, that will either stick to metal like magnetic or has a stand, I would greatly appreciate it. So it looks like I'm gonna have to take this bolt out, which is like the uh, scanner. There's a bunch of bolts. There's another one somewhere over here, one over here. I don't even know if you can see. Uh, yeah, another bolt somewhere up there. Uh, and then I think there's a bolt or two back there. So I'm gonna have to drop this panel this, this kick panel right here uh, and get behind the gas pedal because it goes up and I think that's where the wire is uh, the throttle cable so I'm going to try to do my best to show you what I'm doing it's not going to be very easy so sorry if I can't get the shot So it's really hard to tell, but I had to get out. To, I had to remove the seat because my I'm a big guy. Um, so this black thing right here gets clipped onto that little hole right there, and it's stuck up like that. But there's a lot of play. So what I did was I took a screwdriver and I popped it off. You see that? It's hard to tell. But there's um, like a little groove that slides onto the pedal. Hopefully I'll remove it and uh, be able to show you. So I'm gonna go up top now. I don't know if I have enough time to remove this cable. Uh, I, got, I gotta work in like 15 minutes. I gotta do my hair, change my shirt, hop on my computer. Oh, but it's crunch time. I love to make a pass at the drag strip before this school, uh, before this year ends. And I think uh, in New Jersey, Black Friday is probably the day. So I got it removed from there. I don't know if I caused any damage or not. Um, 
basically it looks like there's this little piece here on the side that you can um, probably just hit with a screwdriver, collapse in and pull out. Um, there's really no videos online about how to do this. So hopefully this helps somebody. Um, I just cut the throttle cable that I had, um, cut it in two spots. I cut, cut this off because I'm gonna try to use this plastic piece. And I cut the grommet that goes into the firewall. So this is the Lockar uh, 36 inch throttle cable out of the package. This is going to attach to a Lockar pedal assembly. The red is the pedal assembly. This will attach to the firewall using these bolts. And then you just keep going all the way here. These bolts are going to attach to uh, your cable bracket, your throttle bracket, and they adjust. And then this is going to attach to your TB uh, just like that. It's going to go um, into it. It's going to go over around your, th uh, your throttle and into uh, the little piece that's open. Uh, you have this little wrench that comes with the kit you stick it in like that and you loosen it up and you can take the whole assembly apart so that's what i'm going to do right now so i have the whole assembly apart my stock third gen pedal had this little plastic piece i cut so I cut the cable off and I removed this plastic piece. I also cut the grommet. So that's what we're going to reuse. We're going to reuse this piece to attach the throttle cable to the uh, pedal. And then we're going to use the grommet that went into the firewall. So this goes on this little cable right here. And I believe it goes, it faces down. Slide it all the way down. So now it's on the on the pedal side, the red side. Then so now the it's back together. We're gonna slide this back on here. So now we have everything back together. We're gonna use that connector piece. So they use a stock pedal, and we're gonna get rid of this piece because we're not gonna spend one hundred and fifty dollars on a gas pedal. So I ended up cutting some of these. Uh, little ridges off and I'm drilling out the plastic screwing this in and then just using this bolt uh, to tighten it up you don't need that bolt it's very tight and snug in there so to get this in it was a little bit of a pain so what I did was I have a like a cheater bar that I cut off a little bit to help remove the spring. So I just slid this over and just bashed on it with a rubber mallet. Oh God, it's so hard. That's what she said. All right, you see that red? That's the new throttle cable. You see that shiny thing in that hole up there? That's the bolt that I just put through the plastic. You can see the plastic right there. And then the clip, I don't, black clip right there. So I'm gonna try to get that black clip into the pedal. Um, and I'm not gonna be able to film that. So I'm gonna try to do that right now. And I can't remember if I put that on right or not. It doesn't look right to me. So I might have to take this out and do it over. Hope not, but uh, we'll see how it goes. Cheers. Yeah.